G'day and welcome back to Buildsum and this is just going to be a quick video to show you how to join a ridge board. So obviously where possible we want to use a continuous ridge board for the length of our roof or the length of our particular section of a roof if you have like a broken hip and valley. In some cases it's just not going to be possible. The roof might be too long for a standard ridge board. So in some cases we have to join it. So the traditional or old time method if you like was to do what they call a scarf joint. So this is a joint that's sort of roughly at 30 degrees and you can see there it just kicks back on each other at the end, gives you plenty of surface area to join to. Join to. And you can nail sort of through this end here and through this end here to join them. And it's suggested in the timber framing code that that happens where the raft is actually a butt or where they meet each other. So that helps to hold the scarf joint together. However, obviously, that's going to take a fair bit of time to do. So the other option, and actually the preferred method, oh, there's the other side of the scarf joint. The preferred method in the timber framing code is to do what they call a um, splice. Okay, so you can see here that they've just butt jointed the two sections of ridge together, halfway between a pair of rafters. And then they've used the fish plate to splice those two pieces together. Now this fish plate should be full depth or close to full depth. You can see in this case I've left it low enough so it just sits underneath our rafter. It's not going to stick up into our roof line. So as close to full depth as you can get it and a minimum of 19mm thick is the requirement in the timber framing code. And it also needs to have 6, 65 by 3.05 millimeter diameter nails on each side of the joint so six on this side six on this side and the same on the other side so we're going to fish plate it on both sides and there we go that's how we join a length of ridge g'day again i'm back just to let you know if you like this video you can subscribe to my youtube channel or follow me on facebook so you don't miss out on more great videos